A Honolulu nonprofit works to teach people with disabilities and kupuna how to better use technology to reach their goals. KITV4's Diana Ko takes us to the Assistive Technology Resource Centers of Hawaii in this aging well. It's all new at 5. <music> But I want you to scroll the, up the middle. And as you do that, you can see it all gradually get bigger here. Retired federal worker Eileen Hayakawa is getting a lesson in how to adjust a computer. I need certain kind of fonts, certain kind of colors or whatever, even the websites, color contrast and all. Hayakawa has a congenital disorder that doctors say leaves her legally blind. She needs to alter the computer settings. The different features such as enlarging and moving around the screen, um, adjusting the different characteristics of the screen. And just magnify on that paragraph there. So. She came to Assistive Technology Resource Centers of Hawaii, or ATRC, for help. It opened in 1991 making sure that individuals with disabilities, but also uh, people who are aging, who are becoming senior citizens, um, have access to technology that will allow them to do the things they want to do. The technology also extends to personal care. These stabilizing utensils are for people whose hands shake, sometimes caused by arthritis or Parkinson's disease. Another service ATRC offers is to go to some clients' homes and familiarize them with the home automation concept. Here's a list of commands that can be taught. So here's an example. Alexa, turn on my light. Okay. Something as simple as being able to feed yourself um, is important. Hayakawa says she's grateful. It's been a very pleasant and um, helpful experience. Fishlowitz Leong adds she hopes to see a law passed one day that would require insurance to cover assistive technology. It allows individuals with disabilities, uh, senior population to uh, be in control of their, have more control over their own life and uh, be able to remain independent if that's their choice. She says keeping technology affordable will help those who need it live their best lives. Alexa, turn off my light. Diana Ko, KITV4. Okay. Island News.